Don, I'm going to get on the record on this one. I think the climate uh, warming alarmists are so far off base that they are a greater risk than the, than the Democrats and Republicans spenders in Congress. Mm, that's and quite a statement. They're in Copenhagen right now, and they're and uh, they're going to make some kind of agreement that's going to kill this economy. Uh, and on top of that, the EPA, as I understand it, just issued new regulations based on this theory about climate warming over which human beings have very little or no control. Am I right or am I right? Well, I, I would say it is a very dangerous step, that's for sure. I'm not sure it would be uh, more dangerous than the spending that's going on. But this is an international conference in, in, uh, in Copenhagen. And, you know, there's, uh, there's several scandals that are going on here. Number one, the Democrats trying to push the whole global warming uh, bill through the Senate where it is stuck and I don't believe that's going to get out, certainly not this year and probably not next year, because Democrats are not going to vote for a regulations and taxes on fossil fuels, oil, coal, that drive those Midwestern and Democratic economies that are run by Democratic state legislatures. Uh, Does what to them? And, drives uh, them into the ground. It drives them into the ground, yeah. yeah. And the other thing, the scandal, of course, is these emails that have somebody has leaked over a number of weeks now, this is in the building. The major media has really ignored this story. But these that, are the global warming people. This is the global warming people. And these emails say, well, we can't really see any global warming. Let me read you one quote from an expert on that. There has been no surface measured warming since 1997 and no statistically significant warming since 1995. And this is from the MIT, Massachusetts Institute of Technology, meteorologist Richard Lindzen. And another quote here, according to satellite data, Global warming stopped about 10 years ago, and there's no way to know whether it's happening now. That's from NASA's senior scientist for climate studies, Roy Spencer. It's the National this Aeronautics is a fraud, and Space Administration for those and they who don't have the advent, they don't have the evidence yeah. that this is going on, but they want to tax and punish and penalize and yeah. regulate us. A lot, of a lot of scientists and politicians have invested their careers in the idea of global warming and the, and the threat it poses to the planet. Yes. And uh, if, if they are wrong... Particularly they think, Al Gore. They will not let themselves be proved wrong if they can help it, right? I think they'll do anything, including squelch the information which this email reveals. That's scary. Thank you very much, Don. You've been very good about this. <laughs> Keep warm. <Yeah. laughs>